Hello, today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a widescreen HD video for YouTube. For this, you're just going to need any type of camera. It doesn't have to be HD, but it can. It still works either way. And Sony Vegas 8 Pro. Um, it doesn't work on any other one so far that I know except for 8 Pro, because I only use 8 Pro. Okay, so you do File, New, and you'll start, and this will be like, before you make a project, you have this thing up. So change the template to HDTV 720p30p, and it'll be high res, high HD, as you can see right there, 12a by 720. So now it's HD. Um, full resolution rendering quality will be at best, that way it's clear. And under audio, you will change the resample and stretch quality to best, just so it's clear too. And um, now your project will already be HD. So then you open up any clip. I'm just going to use, um, it's a video of my iPod. Anyway, I don't have a widescreen camera, but um, if you want it to be widescreen for YouTube, you can click on event pan slash crop, and then this will come up. Change the change default by clicking on this arrow to 1669 16, widescreen. Then it'll be widescreen and stuff, but um, I think it does cut, yeah, it does cut off a little bit of the top and bottom of the video when you do that, but it will be widescreen. So next you do file, render as, and this will pop up. It'll be Windows Media Video V9, and um, oops, sorry about that, I don't think you can see that. Windows Media Video V9, make sure it's not the audio, so we'll get audio and video mixed up, just make sure it's video, and then have default template up. Now press custom, and this will pop up. Change the video rendering quality to best. Audio will be CBR. Under attributes, you'll change this to 128 KBS at 44 KHD or 48. You can choose either one. This one just sounds a bit better, so I'll do that one. Under video, you change it to CBR. And then under image size, you change it to high definition. You can choose either one. I'll just do the normal high definition. Leave frame rate at 29. Leave it at that. And, um, change the video smoothness to 100, which will make it really sharp and clear. Under bitrate, click on internet slash LAN and get rid of ISTN. Make sure it says 3M right there. It makes it a bit faster. And um, I just press OK. And actually, no, if you want to save that, you can name it HD up here and then press save and then from now on when you click this it'll have HD right there so you can just click on that and it'll render in HD so then you just call it um I'll call it test and save it to the desktop and that's about it now you'll have your video it'll be rendered HD and widescreen ready for YouTube okay um hope this tutorial helped and yeah pretty much hope it helped goodbye